Hello, this is Kevin with 3G Store, and today we're going to take a look at the new Cradlepoint AER2100 and take a tour of its web interface. From the outside, the AER2100 is a great looking piece of hardware, but what about its web GUI? Does the admin interface live up to its clean and functional construction? We're now logged into the admin interface of the AER2100, and the first thing you'll notice is that it is truly graphical. There is no command line here, and everything is laid out in great detail. You won't need any special certifications in order to navigate through the interface and successfully administer your network. Once you enter your password and click login, you'll be greeted with the dashboard page. This is a at-a-glance view of your entire network, everything from router information, local networks, Wi-Fi, and your internet connectivity. On the right side of the screen, there are clearly laid out router alerts. Even though this is an enterprise-grade router, the AER2100 includes first-time setup and pass-through wizards to make this as simple as possible. Across the top, there are status tabs for everything from your client list to VPN tunnels and router statistics. The network settings page is going to give you everything you need to control your network. This is everything from content filtering, DHCP and static addresses, firewalls, etc. The other thing you can do here is administer your Wi-Fi and local networks. Clicking on this will bring you to a page that has all the information you need on your local network. The AER2100 can run multiple different LAN connections. These can have their own IP ranges and subnets and can be tied to specific interfaces such as certain SSIDs or Ethernet ports for maximum control. Making more advanced configuration is very straightforward using the edit button. You'll bring up the local network editor where you can make changes to enable or disable the networks. Enterprise grade features like 802.1x security are also available from this screen. The internet tab, as the name suggests, is where you'll be making all of your internet connectivity options. The connection manager gives you a variety of different ways that you can set up your cradle point in both load balance and failover scenarios. On the left, you can organize your WAN connections in order of priority, enable or disable adapters, and load balance between connections if you need to add more connectivity to your network. Clicking on a connection provides access to more information such as the IP address and uptime. When you click the edit button, you'll be presented with more information about that connection. This happens to be the internal modem, so settings for the SIM and APN if required by your carrier are available here. Everything administration related is put in the System Settings tab. This will let you control everything from alerts, Enterprise Cloud Manager, or add or upgrade firmware to the AER2100. Overall, the AER2100's user interface is very clean and straightforward. Instead of spending hours at a command line or lost in a clunky user interface, you'll save time and money by getting your network up and running with the AER in no time at all. For more information, visit 3gstore.com slash AER2100, and for more videos like this, be sure to subscribe to our channel. Thank you.